Hi, my name is Dr. Arlene Wallace, and I am a behavior specialist. So my specialty is assisting parents with learning how to handle tantrums in all the environments. If you're out in public and someone happens to say something to you, you can say to them, listen, my baby is not, ha is not a bad child. He's having a tantrum right now. And if you watch, you might learn something. Give him that, that quick old mommy smile and keep on doing what you're doing. In the event that little John is having a tantrum in an effort to avoid something, no matter what it is, let him have his tantrum, give him his time, wait it out. As soon as that tantrum is over, you have them to return back to what they were doing. If that's cleaning up, if that's putting away something, if that's just sitting there, make sure that it's immediate. That's the most important thing. The most important thing about when we're handling tantrums is consistency. Consistency with limit setting, consistency with expectations, consistency with follow through with expectations. Don't tell Little John something that you know that you're not gonna happen. For instance, Little John, if you don't stop tantruming right now and pick up this stuff, you're not going to Disney World. Now you know you'd already paid for Disney World. You already know that he's going. So make something more realistic. For instance, take away something that he really likes. That's immediate, you can do it and keep it moving. Do not spend a lot of time on tantrums once they are over. Take a deep breath, exhale. Remember that throughout the day that you give lots of verbal praise. Remember that our children grow and learn new behaviors by the positive praise that we give them. So just make sure that you constantly throughout your day catch your baby being good. Good job, fellas.